horse with the speed of light, a cloud of dust, and a hearty high silver. The Lone Ranger. Two white men shoot one of your people. I followed them here. To this canyon? Oh, I thought so. When I got here, they had disappeared. And the Pima they shot. If there is one. Follow me. He was dead when I got here. Not after you got here? This is Willie Moon. Remember the Pima tribe. Standing Bear, Embry's oldest boy. Well, I'm sorry. The only other one he's got is a dumb kid. Dumb kid? For the last couple of months, these have been picking off the tribe's cattle. Well, can't the marshal find out who they are? Marshal? What does a white marshal care about Indian cattle? Still, he ought to know about it. He does. I wrote it myself for all the good it did. We had to take care of our own cattle. Standing Bear did anyway, being the chief's son. I'll get him to his father. I don't need your help. Kimasabe, never in all my life have I heard an Indian speak of a chief's son as a dumb kid. Tano, he wasn't raised as an Indian. He told me on the way here. He was lost as a child during the war and just recently returned. Now, where do you find him? He found me. Well, those two outlaws vanished. Outlaws vanish? The solid rock. Whoever they are, they certainly know this country. Now, what do you think, Kimasabe? Well, I don't know, Tano. Look at this. Made by convict labor in a state penitentiary. I found it where they vanished. And where he found you. That's right. Song of the setting sun. The song of death and sorrow. What do the words mean, Tonto? They are very sad, Kimisabe. They say the sun is going away. Slow it is in its setting. Black bats will be swooping when the sun is gone. Don't it feel so dark? Shandot talash this. The words mean it is all over. The spirit children are beneath. They are moving back and forth. They roll and play it among the tufts of white eagle down. It is all over. He will not come back. He will not rise again. Can you 
still think we can have peace with the whites. Listen to me. You say our government cares nothing for us, but they have sent home our sons and daughters who were lost in the war. And how will we feed them? Our herd grows smaller every day. The marshal doesn't even answer my letter. I say fight while we have something to fight for. No. Him make trouble for his tribe. Him a fool. Fool or rascal? I don't think a fool. We will protect our cattle without war. Your son died trying to protect them. My father still has a son. A son that nobody can say is ever going to be a man or not. Why does Moon say he doubts the boy's manhood? Because it has not been proved yet, Kimisami. There is a test that every Indian must go through before he is a man among men. Alone and without weapons, he must face the terrible spirits of evil. Sometimes the young men die. No man can say how. No man can be held to blame for what the spirits do. You say your father still has a son. All right, then, face the facts. You are his only son now, so you can't take chances. You must be careful. I'll prove I am a man now. Live or die. They're the ones I told you about. The ones who were there when Standing Bear was killed. Chief Embry, I am the Lone Ranger. This is my friend, Tonto. I've heard of you. I've heard you were on our land. I believe we can help you. I found this where I lost your son's killers, the place Willie Moon found me. What does the writing say? It says, made by convict labor state penitentiary. Chief Embry, who is this man? My own sister's son. He was lost in battle when he was a small child. He has just come back to us. Are you sure, Chief Embry? When he was born, I took this from around my own neck and hung it around his as a birth gift. When he came back, it was still where I put it. I see. But now I know who the killers of my son are. Drake and Sloth, two white men. They stole some cattle from us before, went to prison for it. Now they are out, and they want revenge. They killed my son. And you must say so to the government. I'm sorry, Chief Embry. I cannot say of any man these are the murderers. Unless I can prove it. You cannot say it about white men, you mean. But you could blacken my name easily enough because I'm an Indian. You are right, Willie Moon. No, I am an Indian and his friend. I give you your wish. Tonight you will face the spirits of evil. Tomorrow you will take your dead brother's place. You will guard the tribe's cattle with your life. Chief Embry, let us help you protect your son. If anything happens to my son, I will know that Willie Moon is right. I will lead my people into war again. Where were you headed for when you stopped here? Because my advice to you is go there. Tell, tell me about this Indian test of manhood. What must he do to prove himself? He may have a strong medicine powder, Kimisabi. And throw it on fire. It open his ears and eyes to spirits. Close them to men. Is he going to be there alone? Yes, Kimisabi. At a place sacred to his tribe. I can find that place, Kimisabe. I will know it by the sign. Find a town. Maybe we can save his life. a soft spot the day they put you in our cell back in the state pen. Soft spot? I'm making you rich. I know. It seems like we're taking all the risk. You know, stop you arguing. Let's have the news. The news is good. I've got Embry fired up to the point where by next week at this time, he'll be on the war path if he ain't dead. As next of kin, the cattle will be ours. What about his son? Bright Eagle is going to get himself taken care of tonight by the spirits of evil. Spirits of what? I don't get it. Well, they got a thing where a boy goes out alone and wrestles with spirits. First, he knocks himself out with heap strong medicine powder. So he can't hear anybody coming up behind him. Get it? Where does this here wrestling match take place? Come on, I'll show you. Thank you, Mr. 
Sammy. Good. You're just in time. Nothing. Spirits don't have guns. Spirits have these, Chief? Could be. Now, don't rush things when he gets here. Let him work up a lot of smoke with that medicine powder. All right? Keep out of sight. be dishonored. You'll see for yourself. Come on. He's wearing my robe. You said that you'd put him. Right, Eagle. Over there. me, I would be down there, my spirit far away, not knowing they were at my back. Neither will Taro. They see his face. They'll know it isn't you. It's up to us to stop them. Wait. Give them a chance to hang themselves. Yeah, let's give them a little more time. Give them a chance to get real good and dopey. Good. It is not dishonored. Go on with your ritual. We'll camp nearby and take these prisoners to the Pima village in the morning. You can't do that. The ninjas are savages. You call us savages? That's very funny. These are the ones who stole our cattle and killed my son. We have real evidence against them now. We'll send for the marshal as soon as Bright Eagle returns. He will return when the spirits have spoken. These two, we keep them in that corral. I'll stand guard over them. Come, friend, let us talk.
Hold your mitt. Hot go, hot go! Hot go, hot go! They must have heard that shot. Yeah, well, this will stop them. Let's get moving. The horses are on the other side of the rock. Let me come out, Kahe! Embry's kid. You might come in handy to trade with. Come on. Todd 
Margo and I will send the marshal back for the prisoners. They told us the whole story. The three of them were in prison together. My sister's son? He is not your sister's son. Moon killed him to get this amulet. So he could come here, fool you, kill you maybe, and get your cattle. It's all over now. You could be proud that you still have a son to lead your people in peace. Adios. Thanks.